You know, I've lived in this code world 60 years. Six zero. And I've seen a lot. I've heard a lot in my lifetime. I can remember when Jeffrey Dahmer was arrested. I can remember when Son of Sam was arrested. And what's his name? Richard uh, the Night Stalker. I remember when he was arrested. But back in my days, you didn't get instant information like you do now. And so that's what I love about YouTube. YouTube has really allowed me to catch up, so to speak. A lot of these YouTubers will go to the actual crime scenes. Whether it's a parking lot or a lake. You know, so now with technology, I can really go into depth, go deep. You know, I've been accused, not by Facebook, but I've been accused on Facebook by uh, friends and relatives for sharing too much crime and murder. I, I don't agree with them. I do share it, yes. But I'm, I still share good. I share good and bad. But I do not believe in sugar sugar coating. Sorry, my tongue's a little sore. I talk funny. I, I And I apologize for this traffic noise. I do not believe in sugar coating. I like to show the real world. C good or bad. Doesn't matter. And, you know, uh, I, I do things my way. You know, I, I'm, my, I'm my own boss. Anyway, uh, and so YouTube, for example, I was watching about the Colonial Parkway murders in Virginia. And his YouTuber goes to the exact location. A parking lot, a lake. He goes to the exact spot where the murders happen. And I can remember when that happened. But back in my days, you didn't get it. You couldn't get in, in information like you can now. So I like to dig deep. Oh, as I'm watching these videos, video, I'm thinking I remember that. I remember. I, I like to. Uh, uh, I like to play catch up. You know, there's a lot of things uh, when I was a young man that I remember happening. But I never did get into deep because uh, there was we didn't have no technology. So now with YouTube, all I gotta do is type it in. Find I mean there's a 99% chance I'll find a video and watch it. I like information. I hate to be left in the dark, whether it's good or bad information. I never did like to be left in the dark. And that stems from when I was growing up. And, I apologize for this traffic noise. That stems from a, a, not having the technology when I was in my younger days. And I hated that. I hate to be left in the dark. Ooh, I hate that. You know, I like to be educated. I like to have the knowledge of it. Whether, no matter how bad or how good, I want to know. And thanks to technology, I get on YouTube and I can find it out. You know, uh, you know, so I'm just making up for lost time. I just hate to be left in the dark. I hate that. That's a thing of the past. I don't have to be in the dark no more. I got technology. I got YouTube. I got Facebook. So that, that allows me to, to dig real deep. But you know, there's a lot of things I remember. But really lack the knowledge of until now. Now I'm, uh, I've got a lot of knowledge on these things, good or bad. You know, uh, I mean, I, I remember when, you know, a lot of people uh, think about when they, when you think about digital, what do you think about 
when you think of what's the first thing that comes to your mind when you think of digit digital technology huh you don't think of yesterday no you think of today I remember digital 1976 now how do I remember that because for my birthday my dad got me a digital watch I turned I just I turned 13 I became a teenager and my dad thought it was appropriate to give me a digital watch yes digital watch digital has been around for 45 years but we didn't have much that's that's all we just a taste of technology that's all we got a taste that's all we had but digital has been around a long time it just that everything was slow to go to digital but you know uh, you know I remember a lot and that's why I like YouTube I can catch up yeah as I'm watching videos yes I remember that but back in my days information was really hard to come by I remember that now I can learn more I can see the areas the parking lot where it happened you know the exact spot a lot of them you know they'll still stand at the spot you know point the camera down my feet's in on in this gravel I'm in this you know he's comparing pictures there's this tree see the tree here that's where this car was parked the exact location I like to see that even though it's even though it was bad now I got information all the information I want at my fingertips